you guys. Okay, so this is a banjo cat. Um, I love them. I think they're adorable. Get out of the way. But if you want a fish that's going to be out and being exciting, then the banjos aren't for you because this is basically all that they do all day long is sit. And normally they're under the sand like this one is. They prefer sand. I prefer to put them in sand. I keep all mine in sand. All my tanks are sanded. Um, you don't have to do sand, but it's really uncomfortable for them to try and get under the, um, like, gravel, the coarse gravel. You could do really fine gravel, the small pebbles. They'd be okay with that, but heavy-duty pebbles, they're not going to enjoy your tank very much, and they may not make it. I have a total of eight of these guys, so there's two here, there's one back there, and the rest of them are all over there. Um, like I said, they're all under the sand. I took the opportunity to get a video of this one while he's out. They come out for feeding times, where their mouths do, they'll put their mouths out of the sand and suck up shrimp pellets. Um, they do have barbs on them somewhere, I don't know where they are, probably on the end of their fins and on their face. I pick mine up by hand, they don't, I mean, they've never barbed me, I don't suggest doing it at home, I'm just really used to my fish, um, but they are cool, they do look like a little banjo with wings, cute little fish, I wish he'd turn around, he's not going to though. Alright, that's enough for that one.